We're headed to the beaches, the sand, the sun, the fun, Malawi. Here we come. Hello and good morning, everyone. Aloha, everyone. Oh, aloha. <laughs> I say we need to start and end every vlog on this entire trip with aloha because okay. aloha is hello and goodbye. Do I'm I... actually down with that. Yeah. I, yeah, I'm totally down with that. We're getting ready to head out of town to Maui for eight magical days in the sun. You guys, it's going to be absolutely insane. There's been part of this trip where I was like, I don't actually believe we're going. We're not actually going, It right? seems too good to but be true. But it's here. We're packed. We packed up last night. If you guys didn't catch that vlog, go check it out. It was a lot of fun packing everybody up, but we packed kind of to the brim, so I think we're going to add a bag. I don't know. We've got some things upstairs that we need to know. finalize. Thankfully, we do have a midday flight, so it gives us that morning to get that stuff done. Mom's been yeah. to the gym, tying up some loose ends around here. I've got all the vlog gear put together, put out the vlog of packing. That's set. think that we are nearly there. Let's go upstairs, see where we're at on the packing, get those yeah. bags down here and ready to rock. Make sure kids have got all of their power packs charged, yes. videos downloaded. we got a seven-hour flight coming up. Salt Lake City to Maui. We get on in Salt Lake City. It was snowing this morning, by the way. Just throwing that out there. Step off the plane on the island of Maui. Mawawi, Brandon. Mawawi, we gotta get into the habit of saying Mawawi, and you are coming with us. It's gonna be awesome. up here putting together the last few pieces here as we pack up and get ready to get out of town. Like we said, we are leaving a little bit later today, so it gave us the opportunity to go through, reevaluate. We ended up bringing another bag here. This is one of our old bags. The first time we went to Hawaii, we got this set. Just grabbed a medium one to kind of put these loose ends, but mainly, guys, it's for Suvi. So when we come back, we've got some decent space to pack back Suvi's because we kind of packed to the brim in each case, so our four cases were the perfect amount for just what we have. But if you want to bring anything back home, we did need a little bit of extra room. Do know that we want to bring some stuff home. So loading this one up, but keeping it kind of sparse, and then this is that waterproof GoPro bag that will go on the sailing excursions with us can literally be chucked into the ocean and it will keep everything protected to put all of our camera gear, phones, things like that in this bag. I think we are about ready to seal these last ones up. We've got mom, the extra one, mine and Rye guys. The other kids are downstairs already in the kitchen. I think I we're ready to do this. <laughs> We got all of our bags, we got five bags. At least it's all blue, so it is color coordinated. Yeah. Kids have got their carry-ons. You have entertainment devices, power pack, Switch seven yeah. hours. Can I emphasize, seven hours. Seven. Sitting in the same That's seat eight. for seven hours. You don't even do that at school. Are you guys ready for this? Yeah. We are flying to the edge of the United States and then across the ocean, the islands of Hawaii. Landing in Maui. 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 Maui, guys, Maui. Going down, let's load these bags up, grab your carry-ons. Let's hit the road. I think we have enough time. If we leave now, we can swing by the house, just see what it oh. looks like before we head out. Then we'll know how it's changed when we get back. We have got all of the bags packed and loaded. By the way, I went outside to load the bags. It is a lot colder than I anticipated, it's so I grabbed my jacket. Really cold. There were flurries. I was like, I thought it was going to be a midday flight. We could kind of wear shorts and get away with it. I have shorts and flip flops because we're going to step off the plane in Hawaii. I want to be ready for that, but now I'm thinking I should have done pants. I know, it's cold. I in shorts. I'm always cold, so I wore pants. I like this for the flight because it's nice, but now I'm thinking definitely going to be using my blanket. Anyways, oh, yeah. definitely changing climates here. Leaving Utah, headed to Hawaii. Just said this on Instagram saying aloha to Utah and aloha to Maui. The hello and goodbye does that work. I don't I think know. it works. Whether it works or not, the hashtag Mawawi has begun, you guys. <laughs> I think we're ready. Should we go? Let's do it! Ready to go? <laughs> Let's go! Had to do one last stop Ooh, before yes. we head out of town because we want to know what is the difference, what is it going to look like when we get back, guys. So here it is as we are heading out of town. What it's is going good. to change? It's looking fantastic. Like it I has been a picture with my phone. crazy windy though, you guys. So we are wondering if maybe they're in the basement. I don't know where they're at working right now, but they are here. But it has been so windy. We were worried maybe some walls had come down, but they were prepared looks for like that. Looks like everything's intact, right? Everything now. looks good. Roof is still on there, at least half of it, and that's all there was. <laughs> so I don't think if they have blew away or anything. We just wanted to give it one last little look before we head out of town. When we yes, come back, looks so good. see all the progress that has happened, but it does. It looks fantastic. It looks awesome. <laughs> We 
we've parked. We've got a great spot right next to the shuttle pickup, guys. It is frigid. It is absolutely <laughs> it is. I think freezing. it was like 40 degrees. It's windy. Driving. It's light Holy little snow God. every now and then. Sunny beaches of Hawaii could not come soon enough, oh you guys. But they have done away with like our life hack, traveling hack, stop zero. It used to be right over there. It was like the first pickup and first drop off. I don't know how they had that magical stop. So now when you grab a shuttle in the higher numbers, you're going to be on the shuttle for quite a while. But we've decided we actually prefer that because then we get onto a somewhat empty shuttle. There's a place for all of these bags to fit. And then we just have to wait a little bit longer as they pick up people on their way to the actual terminal. We're here. We're ready to get on this plane. We're ready to get out of this cold weather and into some warm, sunny skies. We are here, we are through security right now, and we've kind of got almost like this little system where mom, crew, and Hazy go get pizza or limone. Yeah. Me, Rai Guy, and Brexy, we go hit Garbanzo, Mediterranean it's Fresh. So good. These guys love, what is your thing called? Lafa. A Lafa. These guys get a Lafa. I get a traditional Euro. And then we meet back at the gate and we eat. And honestly, we enjoy it so much. It's one of the reasons that we come so early to the airport because we actually enjoy that first meal sitting at the gate before we get on the plane. So good. We've got our Mediterranean, they've got their pizza, we're meeting at the gate, and then we're taking off to Hawaii. Bro. Yep. By the way, I don't know if we've even told you guys this yet. Dan and Shell are on their way. Oh, They're yeah. coming too. They're almost here. This is gonna be Incredible. I'm so excited. <laughs> been chilling here for a little bit, ate our food, had our wow. pizza, had our Mediterranean fresh. So good. Our plane is actually already here. When yeah. we arrived, was it's at here. the gate, got a notification that our bags had been loaded, and I was like, that can't be. We're like yeah. two and a half hours early. Usually, like a plane comes in, people get off, they clean it off, you get on. Well, this one's been here, it's fueled up, it's mm -hmm. ready to go. So we are boarding in five minutes, you guys. Five minutes. Five minutes, seven hour flight going oh, down. Gosh. I think we're fully prepared. We got everything we need to keep ourselves entertained when we arrive. Yeah. I don't know why, but it just doesn't feel real. Rock, I keep saying that doesn't feel real. I'm like, bro, why. you're about to walk on the plane, bro. That's a yeah. As real as it gets, dude. When we get on the plane, we'll be stepping off in Maui. About 6.30 p.m. Maui time, 10.30 Utah. So it'll be a little bit late, but I'm excited to see these seven hours fly by. <laughs> I get it. We got some fun stuff. We got some new games downloaded on the Nintendo yep. Switches. We've got movies, some videos. Hopefully there's gonna be a lot of snacks. Oh yeah. We are awaiting like a couple of bags. We have like a little bit of extra baggage that we're bringing on this trip. Mm -hmm. So you know, we have our five suitcases that we packed, our carry-ons, but our last two bags just arrived. There they are. <laughs> <laughs> Aloha. Aloha. We have got Dan and Shell in the house. We are headed to Mowawi for Mowawi. eight days of epicness. We've got so many amazing things on tap. And if you know they're coming, you know we're getting the phenomenal photography right here. That cinematic video right here. We got <laughs> Man, that guy comes loaded. That guy is packing right now. Wait, can't say that in the airport. Take that out. <laughs> so if they still let us board the plane, we're getting on next. <laughs> Guys, seven hours from now, we'll see you in Hawaii. Oh yeah. Okay, Maui. <laughs> Aloha. Are we going to Maui? We found the family. These guys are gonna try check in with their boarding pass on their own watches. Each of them got their boarding pass on their watch. We're gonna try it out. Oh, oh there you go, there you go. You're comfort loading. plus You're, though. Yep, there you go. Comfort plus. You're boarding right now. Okay, you ready? Oh, you don't have a watch. Sorry, Haley. <laughs> It worked. Okay, Rexy Doodle, Kirby Doo. Good job. Wait, I thought this one's mine now. Okay, let's get Hazel. That's hey, this little Hazel. princess there. Let's get Dad. We got Dad. Have a great time. There we go. Time. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> on the let's go, guys. Oh it is cold. It's mountainous. There's snow. We're headed to the beaches, the sand, the sun, the fun. Malawi, here we come. Here we go. Are you excited? Hey, In seven hours. Seven hours. Twenty-one B. We just got on the plane and we had booked Comfort Plus, which is something that we like to do, typically gives us a little bit more room. And what we didn't realize is that this plane has been upgraded or updated, retrofitted, I don't know what you call it, but they gutted the first class and made it the Delta One Business Class. And they gutted the Comfort Plus and made it Premium Select. So even though it's just a Comfort Ticket, yeah. these cabins that were previously Comfort Plus, it is now yeah. what they call Premium Select. So it comes with a bunch of cool features that we've never experienced before. So if you're gonna fly for seven hours, dude, I think this is the way to go. So Brexit yeah. Doodle, show us some of the cool stuff they got here. Okay, so first of all, you've got your trusty remote you probably are wondering what it's for well I'm wanting to go to Sky Kids because I want to watch some shows so I'll just go down and then press OK and then if and you wanted I'm to in Sky Kids. and then if you wanted to search Brexy how would you do that you would search and then you would use this keyboard <laughs> type it on the back but it's so cool 
whole bunch of upgraded outlets with USB ports, regular plugs. You've got foot recliners, you can put your legs out, the seats go back, a little foot holder, the remote control that Brexit Little showed you, upgraded TV screen that's a little bit bigger, as well as a little place to hold your headphones. Your headphone jack is actually here comfortably on the middle console in between the two people, and then they've reduced the number of overall seats. Normally there are four across in the middle and two on each side. They've only got three in the middle, as you can see, the guys in the back there, only those three seats to give them more space. We had no idea we were getting this, but we are so excited to be heading to Maui in style. We are filling out our agriculture forms, having our very last snack of the flight. It has been a solid almost seven hours. Oh, they're turning on the lights. No, they're not. Somebody's opened a window. It's very bright outside. I turned on my light. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Sunset is coming. Has this been a pretty good flight, dude? Oh, yeah. It's been so fun. This has actually been like super fun. I don't even want it to end, but I'm so excited to be in Hawaii. Once we fill out this form to have our last snack, we're going to be there, bro. And then I think yes. we'll go get some dinner because I'm hungry. Yes, I'm hungry too. <laughs> Welcome to Maui. The local time is 6.20. Please stay seated with your seatbelt fast and turn on soap to the aircraft just marked at the gate. Yeah! Aloha! Yeah. Hurry, 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 hurry. Guys, you can see the sweat on my face. The humidity has hit. We are in Hawaii! Woo! Actually, we're in Maui. Maui, you guys. We are on the island of Maui right now. We are gonna split up because we've gotta grab our car. They're gonna grab their car. We do wanna grab some food. I think food is on the agenda. Food. Chicken katsu. <laughs> Let's grab our cars. Let's get to the hotel. It's like a 50 minute drive. Kids have hung in there like bosses. You guys are doing so good. Yeah. It's like 11 o'clock at night in their bodies. It is very, very late. The flight, <laughs> phenomenal. Seats were amazing. We had a ton uh, of fun. Watched a awesome. bunch of shows. Got a ton of stuff done. Now let's go yeet. Or eat. Yeet. <laughs> All right, sheesh beast. Here we go. This is when it's nice having your kids grow up to be men. Teenage boys with the yeet power of a full-size dude. Just lifting those bags like there's no tomorrow, like it's nobody's business, like it's Moawi style. All right, guys, we got the bourbon for the week. This is gonna get us on the road to Hana. Gonna get us from meal to meal, beach to beach. But right now, it's just gonna get us home. Oh, oh, we are home. We are home. Oh, whoa. Oh my gosh. We even got whales jumping out of the TV for us when we arrived. <laughs> Guys, come on in. Bring the bags in. We have got, Whoa, look at trash. this. Kitchen, family wow. room, this dining room. Nice. And look, I had them set it up with two beds in here. So yes. we've got two people sleeping in here. Whoa, the bathroom is ginormous. Coming in here, oh, this is gosh. gonna be, I think mine and mom's in here. And then the other nice big one here. So it's in the other one. Holy cow, this walking across crazy. this way. This is wow. incredible. This is home for the next week in Maui, my friends. Woo. What's down here? Oh my gosh, this is like a whole other wing. Oh no, this is mine and mom's. This is ours right here. Holy cow, so the other one in the other corner is one of you guys. Holy cow, you guys. This is amazing. This will be comfy. This will be a fun spot to hang out, edit, eat, stuff like that. This is gonna be rad, you guys. Look at the pool, you guys. That is the pool we're hanging out in tomorrow. Holy, this balcony goes on forever. This is 
insane. I can't <laughs> wait to just like have breakfast right now. I just here. want to see it tomorrow when you can actually see stuff. We're here. We're checked in. We are here. We're, we're actually officially in Hawaii. in Maui right now, guys. And here's the thing. It was totally dark when we landed. I know. So the entire drive was on the coastline the whole way, like a 40 minute drive right next to the ocean. Didn't get a chance to see it. Showed up at our hotel. It's gorgeous. It's stunning. We've got a view of the pool, the ocean, everything. Can't see it. We're going to get the kids into bed. We're going to wrap up day one, which is the arrival day. Not really day one. Technically right now, we just checked the time. It is 940 here in Hawaii. No big deal. That is 140, nearly 2 a.m. for the kids. We're so tired. Let's cross our fingers that they don't get up at 3 a.m. thinking that it's 7 a.m. tomorrow. <laughs> Come back tomorrow to find out, guys. We're hitting the beach. We're hitting that resort pool. We're going to be all over this island, and you guys are going to be here for every minute of it. We love you. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Aloha! Aloha.